Hey guys, my name is Ninja. Welcome back to Pokemon Diamond and Pearl. Last time we faced up again. We basically went to. We had a lot of trouble. We had a lot of trouble, and we also included a new Quagunk to our to our lovely game. <laughs> This time we are going to the gym. This is how you can unlock the gym, you know. If you have done everything and even went to Celestic Town and then did everything done there, you can challenge the gym. You can simply go here to the elevator, will be simply go up. So, instead of hunting you with ghosts, we're going to do the worst thing that is everyone that will be haunting your nightmares. A pop quiz. Question 3 plus 5 plus 7 is answer is. That's actually kind of obvious. That's actually 17. I will do all, only do the correct answers. I'm not going to do anything. Yeah, that's correct. There's a trailer on every single side, but I want to simply go into the gym later. In Pokemon Platinum, you actually going in here first. And this will be actually really difficult. So when next you get the gym leader actually up before I'm going to do anything else, put your name again, and team up. So, let's see what the next question is. Question 12 plus 28C. That's 40. I'm not the one that like, actually best with, uh, with, uh, math. Question 3. Top 3 times 13. Uh, that's 39, I think. Woo! Uh, the first room's answer was 15. And here we are, the gym. Let's just say, actually, many, many people do hate her in Pokemon Planet because her last Pokemon, her last and final Pokemon is a bitch. <laughs> Finally, you have arrived. Since I have become new to this country, always I try to learn new things. In all consciousness, city, I say to myself, in thing, I would sell. That is why I dress this way. That's in the performance. Also, I study Pokemon very much. I've become to be gym leader. And then, uh, so it shall be that you challenge me, but I shall win. That is what the gym leader does. No. I don't know, is it any normal? A magnet thief, Ventina, and see who play. <laughs> I'm not going to continue on the words. She was sent out dribbling, ghost flying pipe, aftermath for its ability, ominous wind, gust, astonish and minimize. If they were Pokemon Platinum, she would have had a dust skull. Uh, Ghost Five never take for its ability of Will O Wiz, Future Sight, Shadow Sneak, and Pursuit. Uh, bulky, bulky Dust Skulls. Oh. Uh, let me actually see what's for part I think I already know which move it is. It's, I think I'm going to try to take my theory. I believe that the, that the, that the move the ghost type move that she specializes in is Shadow Ball, since all because in both in both genres, in both uh, of her battles in in the in both battles in Pokemon Platinum, her um, part of Pokemon the ghost type move is Shadow Ball. Good, so now you can take a nice rest. And of course, especially because of Drifting's aftermath. The hand. 
It would have been a haunter if I actually did that. <laughs> Would have been a haunter, maybe in things I made in my life, I don't really know. Oh, we're gonna send part her a uh, part of the net already! Ms. Magius! She will have a Ms. Magius in Pokemon Platinum as well. It's the same move set in Pokemon Platinum as well. Except it's level 26 instead of, instead of uh, 36. Miss Magius, Ghost Slide, Levitate for its abilities, such as Fairy Force Hold Item, Shadow Ball, Psyve, Magical Leaf, and Confused Bay. In Pokemon Platinum, it is literally the same thing. Ghost Slide, Levitate for its abilities, such as Fairy Force Hold Item, Shadow Ball, Psyve, Magical Leaf, and Confused Bay. Yeah. Not the nice one. Considering her only offensive move is Confused Bay, I'm going to Shuckle Punch. Lower it a little bit. Good. Yeah, I just shut up all the side and will do a lot of damage. <sighs> yep, she's a difficult one. Very difficult. And I have already done the right one. I just know what I can do. Oh, wait, wait, God, I only have one to do it. Um, let me explain you since I want to save my. Oh, yeah, you're yeah, excited. Yeah. Uh, four months from now. Go, Kaza! Siding? No, it comes with a few straight. If. I'm not even gonna do it, I'm not even gonna do it. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. Don't hit your stuff as a piece of it. I'm not even gonna do it. I'm not even gonna do it. I can look at you on the items if you're just gonna go, uh, yes, god, thank goodness. Okay. Here comes the Shadow Ball, because you're such a nice pain in your ass. Uh... Oh, I like it, Sam. Um, what if we put some elegance and actually lost? Just over there. Gonna have you in since I need to actually have a little sacrifice play. <laughs> I do actually have a serrate yet. Oh, that's in the thing they can actually do in March because they're only in the fact that the fact that are need special. That's what you're right. Um, that sucker punch helped me a lot, so I'm gonna make a finish of that. Since she's now clearly all allies attack, I'm going to make advantage of that. I hope she doesn't use Confuse Ray again. Thanks, Saravia. So, XC, come on. So, I'm pretty weak, so I'm pretty sure she will go either for Shadow Ball or Side Beam. Because we'll survive that and also use the citrus berry. Saw it coming. Yeah, I guess that should show how powerful Hermes Magius is. And if you have to do this in Pokemon Platinum, guess how powerful she really is. <laughs> Going, no, no, I'm simply going to, uh, because she will be able to be fast and going to use her claws for side, for side beam and will instantly fail me. That's obviously going to happen. Another sucker punch will, of course, get rid of you. Yeah, there we go.
Gengar, deal with Poison Sign, level 8 voice ability, Shadow Claw, Poison Jab, to confuse me spy. Oh heavens, what is this? Is this my final Pokemon? In Pokemon Platinum, this will be a Haunter, Ghost Poison Sign, level 8 voice ability, Shadow Claw, Sucker Punch, Confuse Way, and Hypnosis. Let's see what I've got me. Super, yeah, I should have expected that. Mm. Yep, she's a tough one. Let's try this again. Also, I have added a little powerhouse here just because I don't want to deal with that stupid aftermath. <laughs> It's just this guy real quick since I always show you where this book comes come from. Yeah, it comes to Ice Punch. Want to get rid of this guy really quick and then going to continue on with my friends. Alright, it's the aftermath. Aftermath. Pokemon. And Pokemon Double Come Back. Ms. Mac, yes. You again. Uh, I'm after part of Simba right here and now. Then magically might give me trouble there. But I wonder if we'll let's see what we can here. Consider, uh, is Ms. Mac is faster though? That's my question. Yes, it is. Oh, glass cannon. Oh, wait, what? It has that. Ooh! It has another side beam, but of course you will survive that. Ooh, barely was hanging on. But of course you will survive this for pursuit. After fact, you sit this berry and immediately get rid of me. But when Pardos did great, she was he was able she was able to get rid of that uh okay, so good job in Pardos. You did great, excellent, awesome, amazing And guy, you're up next. That second punch will get rid of that steel in his magnet immediately. I don't know if that's stupid confusion or anything. Get used to confusion. Now, unless I run. Come on, come on, come on. Stop the punch. Please don't hit yourself in the confusion. Of course you do. Magical leaf. That's a, that's a grass type move. Don't hit yourself in confusion. I cheats, my friends. Another magical leaf. There's a friend in the here, but of course it doesn't work in my favor. Of course not. That goes with Magius. One of the remains of that stupid, stupid Gengar. And you leveled up. That's amazing. Gengar.
Oh heavens, what is this? It is my final Pokemon. What is this? Confuse Red. Again. Which way is a normal time? Of course, I'm hitting myself in confusion. There you come, fight. In spite of this. Thank you! You are fantastically strong. I know now why I lost. I am a dumbfounded. So very, very strong. You, your Pokemon, so strong. Your power is admirable. I shall honor it with this gym badge. The Relic Badge. The badge will allow you to use HM Move Surf outside of battle. Also, you can make use of this technical machine. That's what I get. That's dear. It contains Shadow Claw, a very stunning move it is. It's what it's it's turn twinkle often. Oh, I just learned what I'm going to be doing this episode. Another boss fight that I can only show in Pokemon Planet. Oh, we're going to have some. Uh, Introductions to very special Pokemon. We're going to do an event this episode. That's awesome. I guess I can finally explain events. In case you want to know what I mean with that. If you want to know what I mean with that, there are few of Pokemon uh, on on the Sinnoh region. Therefore, there's of course some few events. One of them never released outside of it is never released, even not even in Japan, but I will still show that event event because of uh I'm using that on the on the emulate so I can use cheat codes or active replay codes in order to get that. So I'm going to show at least a few events. Oh, it's something. I'm so glad to see you. You're not very easy to track down. My grandma told me about that what that, that what took place in Silver Town. Thank you for what you did in the rules. That team collected. I thought they were just an incentive bunch of creeps. So, talking about how they are going to make a new universe and all, and that weird and that we were a that I would trust you, I thought they were harmless. It appears as if they were a lot more trouble than I thought. Hmm. I mean, stealing and hoarding Pokemon, not just playing well. By the way, did you find the ruins interesting at all? If you did, you may want to visit the library in Kalaudi City, Kalaudi City. You might find that they have some ancient books that you might find it interesting. It may also be helpful to complete completion of Pokedex. I think you ought to go there. So, okay, bye bye for now. And, yeah. We basically going to have a very special boss fight. In Pokemon, in Pokemon uh, Pearl. In case you never know what I mean with that, we're going to have a special event that is can only be shown there. In Pokemon, there was of course an event there which gives the an item called the. Uh... Thanks to Electrify, you did uh, there was a great help in that boss fight. <laughs> and I'm going to show you some a lot of great ba battles. To reach kind of lime city, I kind of lay city. Damn it, Jay Ritz. I'll just do this right here now, so I don't have to deal with that. 
Chains and Wars. And let's go to Jubilee City. I can't believe I'm actually going to actually be the going to show the very first event in this game. It's a rather dark one, actually. <laughs> And surprisingly, this is actually the only event I am able to show you in the main story. The rest are actually in post-game, actually. So, do I have any repels? Uh, do I have any repels for what I'm going to do now, or am I going to have some trouble? I didn't think I'm going to be in this circle, did I? No, it is. So, let me just quickly change that. <laughs> okay, I got the Pokemon for sure. <laughs> now let's use the Repel again, so that I don't wait anymore. <laughs> Need more of my time here. <sighs> and then we're going off to try to get that mysterious Pokemon. I hope you're excited for that. Uh, I really hope you're excited for this. Uh, don't need to fight here. <laughs> oh, can see! Oh, you look puzzled. You wonder who I am? I'm Professor Rowan's assistant and Don's father. The professor asked you as if I appropriate your program expertise, so I've chosen this part on the hunt that you passed through. Second, may I have your Pokedex for a moment? Let's see what we're supposed to put in here. Oh, done! I've upgraded your Pokedex. I should explain how it's been upgraded, shouldn't I? It can now explain the images of male and female Pokemon. Okay, I'll leave that to carry on with your project for Professor. May I also keep you into an I.I. for Professor for, for, for Team Galactic? The Professor is concerned about what happened to your life situation. There's probably nothing to worry about, over. I'll be on my way now. So now that we arrived here at Kanalei City, I will see you guys in Pokemon Pearl for when we are going to tackle on what mysteries lies in this strange house. See you guys then. Okay, this is how I'm going to explain events for you. When you got some item called the member car, the member pass, which I also will explain in this footage that I actually have recorded for you guys. Um, you will get to a place called, if you go in the harbor and you go to a place called New Moon Island because you will succumb to the darkness. You get a nightmare and you will travel to that place where that Pokemon exists, lives. And when you find the Pokemon, you find, you're going to be Belle and apparently it is here by the voice of Arceus, a, a certain Pokemon you will meet later, that I will talk about later, is... We'll talk about that it, uh, that it will isolate himself because it was so powerful and the uh, nightmares. So, but I will buy the Pokemon, of course, with how I show you these boss fights. Oh, another thing. Um, I am using action replay codes for uh, these things. I will use the wild, uh, the wild Pokemon modifier in order to show you at least the boss fight and not actually talking on a blank screen. So here you go. Apparently people couldn't hear me if I had the commentary on, <laughs> so this is going to be post-commentary. This is Darkrai, the pitch black Pokemon. Darkrai is a dark type with a lot of good moves, we have a lot of good moves for you guys. When you face him here in, in, in actually not here, but if, when you face him in uh, New Moon Island, he has a lot of great moves for you potential. Darkrai has that huge for its ability, which is a special move, a special ability that uh, inflicts pain for those who actually are asleep. Only on his opponent, so. Darkrai, um, when, um, when giving uh, the ability, when giving the things you move, Dark Boy is also a massive threat. Because of this, Darkrai is not too much. Darkrai has a lot of 
I will use mass balls on these special events because of what we do for do. Yeah, Dark Rider is a mix is a special sweeper. Not that bulky and it only is really good for real mix. A Dark Rider also comes with in one of the events Dark Rider actually was giving away. Dark Rider had four times spatial event, which it was really good. And for sure it was Dream Eater, no no, Dark Pulse. Um, Dark Void, War Time, and Special So Special Sweeper, so yeah, that's all about, about Dark Knight. I also love this freaking uh, music you're actually hearing, it's so intense. <laughs> I really don't have anything to say about Dark Knight. It has a lot of great moves. Also, I forgot to mention that Dark Knight's uh, Sleep Edition move, Dark Void, um, got a distinct nerf. In Generation 7, in Pokemon Sun and Moon, it set it gained an uh, unfortunate loss of its accuracy to a mere base to an accuracy to 50%. Yeah, that's Dark Rise unfortunate fate you just had to endure. That actually really is unfortunate. Now that we have talked my ass off about Dark Knight, let's use one Mass Ball and we can spoke an entry for you guys. Because Dark Knight is so amazing. Many people do like Dark Knight. Also, the level is here nowadays a little bit just real really kind of crazy. So, let's see what Dark Knight's Pokemon has for you. It has a pixel footprint, that's actually kind of ironically. Actually, I do like the it has a pixel footprint. Darkrai, the pitch black Pokemon. Folklore has it that on moonless night, this Pokemon will make people see horrific nightmares. Yeah, it really has a actual feet, as you can see it at. It basically has a little, uh, a speed in that, uh, but it loves actual float, actually. Yeah, it does have feet, but it actually loves the float. And there we go! That's how you will get to about Darkrai. One of, the, one of many difficult Pokemon and legendary Pokemon away from you. See you guys next time.